602, now to that breaking news in Queens, a row of power lines came crashing down onto parked cars. Hundreds of customers are now without power. Eyewitness News reporter Derek Waller just arrived at the scene in Kew Gardens Hills. Derek? A scary situation here, certainly something you do not want to wake up to. Look down the street here on Casino Boulevard. You see that red minivan, and there is a power pole that has snapped in half and is resting on top of that car. Thank goodness nobody was injured here, but we have a lot of damage all up and down the street. It's at the intersection of Casino Boulevard and 73rd Avenue. If you look down the street, you see there's power poles all over the place, wires, uh, just a dangerous situation. We have Con Ed out here and Spectrum Cable actually trying to clean this up right now. If you want to look at some video from earlier, this happened overnight, uh, and you can see just the extent of that damage from overnight. Uh, uh, some poles and wires on top of cars, and this intersection obviously right now is closed as they try to clean this up. Uh, no word on what actually caused this. That's really what people are trying to figure out, whether the pole was rotting and then snapped it in half on its own, or if perhaps a vehicle hit it. Uh, that is something that they are investigating, certainly something that we are asking and looking into. But again, the breaking news right now, we have an intersection here, Casino Boulevard, 73rd Avenue, closed because we have a couple of power poles that have snapped in half and fallen onto the street and actually fallen on top of some uh, some parked cars. Again, a power crews out here trying to clean this up as we speak. There are a couple of buses, the Q25 and the Q34, that are diverted right now because of this cleanup. Report